guys, welcome back. We're tying another wee spider pattern, and this one's called the um, GP Spider. So the hook in the vise is a size 12 Amazon B175. Uh, the thread I'm going to use to tie the fly is Uni Thread 80 in black. So we'll just come in and get the thread started behind the eye of the hook. I'm just going to run my thread down, as we always do, to pass the point of the hook and remove the waste tag of thread. Now the tail on the fly is GP um, tippet fibers. You can use natural, uh, you can use dyed orange. Um, in this case I'm going to use this, this is dyed yellow. Um, I do have dyed orange there. I'll just tie it in the yellow for you. I've had this sitting out and you only want a, a slim bunch of these type of fibers you don't want to be overdressing these wee flies. You just want this sort of way around about the length of the body. A couple of turns just to catch that in. And then come in and trim away the waist tag of the GP tippet feather fibers. Now the rib is going to be the you need French oval silver tinsel, an extra small, or you can use silver wire. So I'll just tie this in. A couple of turns just to hold the body. You need floss and black. So just get a length of this off. just use the thread or use a UTC thread to tie the fly. Now, I'm just going to put this into length and then we'll just work the thread up tying in all our materials. Make the whole way right up to the eye and then just bring it back down again into position. Then we'll come bring up our body material which is our black floss. I'm just stretching this out as we go just to flatten up the, up the body. Touch and turns. Follow this around with your thread. A couple of times we'll catch that in. Come in and trim away the excess. You'll bring up your rib. And you're looking four turns up the body to there. Find this around with my thread. A couple of tight turns to secure that in. Come in and trim away the oval silver tinsel. Now the head haggle or the haggle. You're just looking at a light furnace hen. And this is just a, a waiting. cape that I'm using. So I'm just going to stroke back the fibers just to reveal the tip. Just offer this up to the hook. Catch it in a couple of turns. Fold the tip back. A couple of turns back up over the tip on the haggle. I'm just going to level this a wee bit here at the head. Then come in and break away your tip. And you're probably going anywhere between a turn Turn and a half and two turns of the haggle will do nicely. That's one. Right, let's put another one in. That's two. And then we'll just come around with our thread. Catch in the haggle. A couple of tight turns. I'm going to fold the, the stem back. So I'm just going to strip off the fibers just to reduce the bulk. Fold the stem back. And bring your thread from the eye up over the stem of the haggle, nice and tight, keeping your thread tight. You can break away the tip and just come in and throw in a whip finish. Now, this is like the other wee spider pattern of tag for the channel. The wee flies will work well both on the rivers and the locks, even on still waters, reservoirs. 
these wee flies will work. And then just to finish off, just going to come in just a wee coat of clear varnish straight the whole way right around the head. Don't want to get under your haggle. Just take your time. A bit of waste wire on my desk. Just come in and clean out the eye. And there you go guys. That's the uh, GP spider. So look, like, tie a few of those up. Hopefully they can get you a few fish. As always, many thanks for taking the time to view the video. I really do appreciate it. Um, if you like the wee videos I'm putting together and you haven't yet subscribed to my YouTube channel, please consider subscribing. Um, and until next time, stay safe and tight lines folks.